realized <coughs> the only common solution I had between the two installation installations was the fact that I had the ICT plugin removed in both. And so if you, if you have the ICT plugin installed, it, your your game won't even start. Okay, that's so getting with the ICT plugin. Definitely, I know that's part of the solution. Get rid of that, so at least your game will start. But with the question is whether the game will have sound or not. And I'll tell you now that at least um, uh, under the parameters I have in the, the second Ubuntu 10.04 installation, it um, removing OpenJDK and renaming the live, <laughs> live JSON as a data so file with something else is, is not the reason why it worked, because those things weren't done, right? So it's just a matter of logic. So now, now it is, you know, how am I going to approach this problem? How am I going to solve it? Because I, I really want to find out what the real answer is. And I think the answer is going to be complicated. The answer is, is going to be like what I tried to say last night in my Discord video is that I think it's going to consist of, um, well, if you have this module, which is basically it's a Linux kernel driver, and it's not a driver in the sense that you would think of in Windows. In Windows, you think of a driver, okay, I need the driver for this camera. You stick the CD and you, you, you install one thing and you have the driver. Well, it's not necessarily the same in Linux. In Linux, you don't have just the driver. There's actually several drivers that interact with this camera to allow it to run. There's a, just a USB driver, a USB sound driver. There's the, you know, and there's several other drivers that are involved and one one of the first things that I noticed and I haven't gotten to a solution yet so I'm going to be working on this for a while this is going to be a, a series that I do a series um, is it okay here's, here's the list of drivers that I that are installed in Ubuntu 1010 and each one of these that are yellow are drivers that were not present in Ubuntu 1004 and you can see some of the details here like to make my point about you know, it's not just one driver that controls one piece of hardware. There may be several drivers per piece of hardware, or, or just for sound. All these ones that have SND, all those presumably affect the, uh, the system's ability to play sound, or record sound, or capture sound. Okay, and then in Ubuntu 10.04, all these drivers here on this page that are highlighted, and on the one on the next page, which isn't material to what I'm talking about, are, are, I don't think, are, are, are missing from Ubuntu 10.10, which includes the Sound PCM OSS, the Sound Mixer OSS, the Sequencer Dummy, and the Sequencer OSS, those four over there. This list was generated by running the lsmod command at the command line and redirecting the output to a text file. It, it just... Um, I won't go into it now because I'm in Windows and I don't think anybody's going to be able to see the screen anyway, but uh, basically you open up a shell and you type lsmod, put a space there and you use the greater than sign pointing towards the lsmod, another space, and then you just pick a name for your text file and uh, it'll redirect the output to that instead of displaying it on the screen you can print it if your printer is set up. Okay, so part of my investigation here is telling me that I have actually five sound drivers, but of course USB, I'd assume that USB has nothing to do with it, because I when you do um, Pogo, of course, you're not going to be using, I'm not using my camera to play Pogo, so it's got to be one of these, the fact that one of these four drivers, not got to be, but it could be, that the fact that one of these four drivers that are installed in Ubuntu 1004 where it works right, but not installed in Ubuntu 10.10 make the difference so that the fact that I uh, if, if you have those drivers installed the result is it seems to be that you don't have to rename the, the like JSON ALS S or the OpenJDK right now that's 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 my theory but it can be an awful lot of other things um, hopefully in the last couple minutes here I'll be able to get to them there are a number of okay so the kernel has its own drivers and basically these are all just programs that allow uh, the operating system to receive sound input and to send sound output um, in a very basic sense and that is from programs but there are a number of programs that actually affect 
your sound. And some of these are low-level utility programs. Okay, so um, this one unstable this. Okay, and those are. This this list was generated from I think Ubuntu ten ten. I should have labeled it. Um, so you know I don't have a list from ten oh four or vice versa. I don't have a list from ten ten. But these are all of the programs that have the name Pulse Audio somewhere or Pulse somewhere in its name. You know, so there's all these programs that are have something to do with Pulse Audio, except for maybe the VLC plugin, um, could have an effect on Java. Pulse Audio works around Alza, sometimes with it, sometimes overrides it. It still isn't clear to me what, how the integration works, but all these Alza, um, Alza, Pulse, in a general sense, Pulse does require Alza, but some of my test results came up. Uh, that it just I I'm not <laughs> in my first video where I came up with the the the, the solution I thought I had uh, I couldn't sort out whether Pulse was getting instructions from Alza or or or, or Alza, Pulse was being bypassed or or what so um, okay then we got all these G Streamer programs that could have an impact on it so I, you know. Then I got these other ones that I just happened to write down. They happen to be installed in 10.04. I guess these are all lists from 10.04. These are all Java programs, and those are the OpenJDK programs that I had installed there. It's probably too many to read, but eventually when I'm done, I'm going to make a concise list of, of material items that affect this whole thing. Okay, so... So the, so the big... So the big thing is, is okay. Well, I've got two identical partitions. I guess 